Hey, it's Brian with Team Aquascape, and I don't know where to start. Maybe a small apology. For some of you, you may or may not have noticed that we did not have a Tuesday nor a Thursday video. Don't be alarmed. It's not that we're going anywhere. Nothing's happened. We're all healthy. It's a brand new year. Happy New Year! It's because we're making some major, major changes, and that's what I'm here today to discuss. We are going to build a pondless waterfall. The best way to learn anything is to teach it. We are rocking and rolling on this pond. First and foremost, we're going to one day a week, and it's not a bad thing. I know a lot of you are gonna be like, oh, boo hoo hoo, what are we gonna do on Tuesdays and Thursdays at 9 a.m.? And I'm gonna tell you what, here's our new format. We'll still be using our usual days, Tuesdays, Thursdays, or Sundays to air content, but we'll work to air once a week. And the reason we're doing that is we felt it was more important than instead of giving you more content, give you the best content. We are shooting for quality over quantity this time around. We're still going to produce 52 total videos for the year, which means some of our content may be unpredictable. You guys want to learn how to help that? After you subscribe, or if you do already, click that little bell icon. That enables you to get notifications every time a video of ours airs, and you'll never ever feel left out or thinking you missed a video. So that's what we're doing. We're going to once a week, and we're going to be doing all kinds of stuff. Greg, the pond guy, had a vision, and the vision was showing more of what we do behind the scenes. The goal is to show you what it takes to operate the world's largest waterfall and pond installation company. Does this mean we're not gonna be showing you the construction techniques? No, no, no. In fact, going down to once a week will make our build focus content even better. So of course, we're not gonna show you every build of the 2023 season, but we are gonna show you the ones that are gonna be the most memorable, the ones we know you're gonna wanna see. Even more important, the ones that you're gonna learn from the absolute most but this means the videos may be a slight bit longer so be prepared for that so excited because we're still going to be showing you the construction techniques but we're also going to be showing you what goes into our day-to-day -day a lot more with the retail store in fact let's jump over there right. yep i'm here in the retail store and it is a magnificent place you're going to see a lot more of this young lady i'm Karina, the retail <laughs> store manager and what do you do here i maintain the store <laughs> and which isn't that easy there's all kinds of stuff we have tons of pets we have tons of fish we have customers coming in and out all the time looking for inspiration Kareen is she is the face of aquascape as everybody walks in and this is an unbelievable place and I wanted to take you guys way more through the journey of our customers first impressions as they come through this store and so many of our leads for construction actually start at this place as they come through and they look at different patio bowl setups they decide if they want a goldfish pond versus a pond on this waterfall. Are iguanas part of their future? Oh, <laughs> he says yes. <laughs> what pond is right for you? So I want you to meet Kareen. I want you to meet Amanda, Danielle, Haley, everybody that basically keeps our hamster wheel running all the time. Hi. <laughs> Without those girls, our support staff, and I call them our support staff, but really they're the ones that keep us motivated, keep us running. They are the first impressions to all of our customers. They're managing our maintenance schedule. They're managing our construction schedule. They're calling in our stone orders. They're calling in all of our machine requests. And speaking of maintenance, another thing I need to share with you guys is Chris Hansen's new role. So Chris Hansen has been promoted and this is an awesome opportunity, not just for Chris, but for Aquascape. Chris Hansen has been moved over to maintenance, which is an awesome opportunity, not just for us, but for all of you guys, because Chris is gonna be able to share with you some of the things that happen in our maintenance department. And the things that happen on a regular basis are way more like my pond has a leak, my pond's pump is out, my pond has string algae, my pond has green water. And so Chris is gonna be able to share with you guys all that stuff. Chris, hate hey. to interrupt. It looks like you are in the middle of some big epic project here, huh? but I was just letting people know for 2023, your new role. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you want me to tell them about my new I role? I want you to tell them a little bit about your new role. So I am super excited about this upcoming season. And a big reason for that is I get to really dive in a lot with the service guys that are out there in the field and really collect those little nuggets of information that you've been sorely missing 
because there's so much opportunity for you guys to gain the knowledge that we've gained over years and years of experience. So I'm hoping I can bring that to you guys. Awesome. So really excited about that. Super excited. I think everybody's going to be excited about that. Chris, give them a little teaser. What are you working on? Um, this is going to be a gymnasium for small marmots. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. Once we figure out what a marmot is, it'll be exciting. No, we are redesigning our koi tank back in here. So again, bringing you that retail store, which is going to be super, super exciting. So excited again about Chris. What else do we have new? Let me tell you. So you thought all of that stuff was already so much more. We're just scratching the surface. Something I am genuinely, genuinely excited about is sharing with you guys way more the design process that goes into building a pond. How do we design 10 foot high waterfalls? How do we design seven by nine foot ponds in a backyard? How do we design swim ponds? How do we design pondless waterfalls? Does it start with the drawing or does it start with a garden hose? These are things we want to share with you because we think it's so important. It's all the behind the scenes things. I even want to try to take you guys on some consultations whenever possible. Why does a customer choose aquascape construction? Why does a customer want a pond? Why does a customer want a pondless waterfall? How many years have they been thinking of doing this? How much money does it cost? All these different little things we need to share with you guys and we need to share with you our customers decisions on why they choose that aquascape lifestyle i would also love more than anything to get the authentic reaction of our customers and not just at the end when we plug in the pump and there's the tears of joy coming down their face i don't want to just show you guys that i also want to show you the emotional roller coaster that a lot of our customers go through how super excited they are when we show up and how that excitement quickly changes when it looks like a bomb has gone off in their backyard to full circle back to super excited that we finished and their pond is their dream pond and something they've always been wishing they had. I need to share that kind of stuff with you. I'm so excited to do it. So welcome to our construction bay. This is where the magic starts every morning. We come in through that door at 625. We walk over through here. We come into what we call our construction office which is really just more of a cave of sorts. The very first thing a lot of people do is come over to the coffee machine. There might be something in the fridge, but at 6.30, everybody meets at this table and we go over our, what used to be 2022 goals. There's now gonna be 2023 goals. Go over our wins for the week, our losses for the week, goals for the day, goals for the rest of the week, challenges we may or may not have, and that kind of stuff. I need to get you guys involved in that so you see what goes on in our construction life. It's not just about digging holes and moving rocks. It's about staying organized. It's about why is that fitting center behind us so important on a daily basis? How important is this machine versus that trailer? I'd pick that 10 times over that. But I think you guys need to understand why. We want to share all of that kind of stuff with you. The whole idea behind the change of this is to show you way more the day in the life of construction, whether it's the marketing, the accounting, the team building that we're doing, our customers, our vendors, our retail store, all the logistical things that happen in order to run the world's largest waterfall and pond installation company. Hopefully you guys are excited about this. I know we are super excited. Is it going to take a little bit more work? Yes, but it's so worth it. And it's really a big thank you to all of you guys, people that have supported us from the very beginning. Tell me in your comments what you're even looking for. Hey, we'd really like you to focus on this. We don't want to see any more of this. Or, hey, Brian, take me on another pond tour. We really loved that whole pond tour that you took us on, that virtual pond tour. They, just different things. There's no right or wrong answer. You guys, hopefully, you're as excited about 2023 as we are here at Team Aquascape, and Team Aquascape means everybody here in this building, not just myself and Chris. All right, guys, you know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe, tell all your friends, and we're gonna have fun this year. See you soon, bye.